All right, folks, so let me give you a hint for today's exit slip. So the exit slip gives you a couple of pieces of information. Number one, it tells you that BD bisects angle ABC. So let's draw that out. BD is this ray over here, and apparently it bisects this angle, ABC. So what does bisect mean? Bisect means cut something in half. So that means this angle, 2, is equal to this angle, 3. Okay, that's all good. Okay, we have one other piece of information. We're told that angle 1 is congruent to angle 2. All right, so how does that help? Well, if angle 1 is congruent to angle 2, we know that angle 2 is also congruent to angle 3, right? Because that's the definition of an angle bisector. Now, they also give us the information that angle 1, angle 1 is congruent to, congruent to angle 2. And that's a given, right? So if angle 1 is congruent to angle 2 and angle 2 is congruent to angle 3, well then by the transitivity property, angle 1 is congruent to angle 3. Okay, great. So we know that 1 is congruent to 3, and now we can finish our business. Note how 1 is over here, 3 is over here. You can even imagine, you can imagine some parallel lines here. Let me draw them out for you, so you don't have to imagine. Here's one parallel line, here's the other one. Uh, this orange line here is the transversal that cuts them up. And notice how angle 1 and angle 3 are corresponding angles. So if you have parallel lines, corresponding angles should be equal. And in fact they are. And so we have just concluded that AD is parallel to BC. Line AD is parallel to line BC. And we're done. We are done. And that's that. All right. So hopefully that hint was helpful. If you need any more, check out the solutions.